Hello Superherd and welcome back to Super Mario Odyssey and today we'll be thoroughly exploring the Mushroom Kingdom. Let's go! So things might be a bit of a challenge because we have a lot of moons to get to. We have 15 more purple coins to find and almost 100 left of moons. Of course, a lot of those moons are Toadette moons. A lot of these we have found and like have gotten to others, I guess we still haven't. I don't really know. Um, we'll have to check in depth. Like, what is this one? Collect souvenirs and stickers. There are some still some stickers we're missing then. Okay. I guess that is something. Maybe we will, of course, this isn't gonna be the last episode of the series or anything. We still have a good chunk more to do, but once we find every power moon, apparently the we have like a boss rematch or something opens up a lot, according to a lot of you. So right now I'm just gonna be focused on getting done as much as I can as possible. I see some purple coins here we can get. Just like that. I sort of wish I would have saved Mushroom Kingdom until the end, like all of it, because that way I would remember what I explored and what I hadn't. But for now, since it's sort of just a bit of a mess, I should just do whatever I feel I need to do, which is a lot of it. So let me get up here, and we will start off by, I know that there's a golden nut over here, and we can bring this to the shop, not the shop, what am I talking about, the, uh, the garden over here, and this should be a pretty easy one. There's also sheep that we need to bring way over yonder, so that shouldn't be too bad. But there's just, there's just lots and lots to do. We gotta check every one of these things and make sure that we've done them. But I'm pretty sure we've done the most of them. You can never, you can tell by if the hat house is open. Um, I'm quite proud of this garden. I would be too. So there's that done. I can open up this bad boy and get one of the stars. I missed the stars. It's awesome. So there's that. Gardening for Toad. Garden, see it's been like what? I gotta say like 20 episodes since we've last been here. It's been a while, like the I think there's more episodes in the after game than there has been in the main game at this point. It's been crazy, or maybe I'm not right with that, I can't remember. But there's just been a lot of episodes in this series. Okay, so I'm pretty sure we've gotten you, but I gotta make sure. If I can just get a little bit closer. Where'd you go? I totally lost you. Oh! Come on, yes! Yep, already got you. Glad to find out though that I did. There's just so much to do around here. Like, I really don't know where to start. It's super intimidating. And there's more people at the beginning now. Like, that's another big thing. We've been in here. I remember Ryoshi removing that and we're, we were doing that. So maybe I don't have to worry about that, but I should probably talk to every toad I go by. And... See that cave? I think some of Yoshi's favorite food is back then. I know. Snake, shake a bit of this, shake a bit of that. Yeah, I'm learning how to shake it. <laughs> Toads can be cute sometimes. Uh, let's have you not walk off the edge. And we can bring you across this way. We can just, if you, if I see a, a sheep, I'll deliver him. And right now, this sheep is a sheep I'm delivering. So, first off, I hope you don't get taken out if you land in the water, but I won't have to worry about it because I didn't hit you in the water. And the delivery spot should be right down around here. Yep, right there. Okay, so where'd you go? You're over here now. You think that some of the sombrero guys would be able to help me because they're pretty used to herding sheep. But, nope, they're not interested. It's a job nobody likes to do. So there's one of your sheep, buddy. Hope you appreciate that. Of course, you're looking for them. My six sheep are for six. Please bring them back to me. I thought those only going to be three. Seems it's easier to hold sand than to keep sheep. Malfunction, cannot predict pattern of sheep. Per perambulation. Oh, is this another gold nut? This is a normal nut. That is, that's a gold nut. I was about to throw it off the edge. Like, darn normal nut, I don't need you. So we can bring this to the garden, and then if we find any sheep, we can, deliver them, like, okay, this sheep is really easy. I actually might be able to chase you into the pit without dropping this nut, so this will be two out of six, so we're uh, getting pretty good into this. One third of the way there, and all right, dun, 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 dun. Let me uh, jump. I'm learning how to water plants from a true master. Cool. I like how this is a tanuki tree. Maybe there's more to do there. It would be cool if there's a secret tanuki leaf. The jumper challenge in our Metro Kingdom is zippy skipping. Uh, I don't jump or volley, but do follow those sports on the ranking boards. Simply must try beach volleyball in the Seaside Kingdom. Pure joy. The music is the best, people are dancing with them. Yay, there's a whole world of mushrooms out there. We cook with mushrooms so much, you wouldn't believe it. Are there, are the are the mushrooms here tasty? Hmm, well, don't eat the toads. Um, neither everyone, everyone from everywhere is here. Indeed, a fountain, a plaza, exquisite. What a wonder of moisture. Cool, everybody seems to be having a good time. I really appreciate that. So I'm gonna, we already used a dog to get a moon. I don't think there's any more, or a star. 
but you know what I mean. I will eventually drop by the towers to check out more of that, but for now, I'm just gonna deliver this. And then we only have one more nut to deliver, which will be great. Of course, we need to be able to get the things from the nuts, but we'll worry about that later. Oh, oh hold on. You know what, I'm gonna throw it in this one. Thank you. <laughs> so what else is around here? Ooh, we've been down here, I'm almost positive. There's some purple coins, and that's really it. But clearly there's a mushroom here, as if it wants me to get on top of here. There's a lot of coins, at the least. All right, got a bunch of coins there. I have lots more coins to find. I might actually have to, between episodes, grind coins, because we still need to spend thousands. We need to spend 9,999 for the skull, another 3,000 for one costume, and then I think another set of 3,000 for a different costume. So we got lots to do on that front. You, we already got what we need from you. I wanted to check out these pillars here. Like, what can we get from doing this? Probably a bunch of nothing, but they are pretty peculiar. Not peculiar enough. I mean, maybe I should have butt slammed them, maybe that would have a different purpose, because I know in Mario 64, that was something you had to do, is butt slam those kind of things. So, maybe that's what I'm doing wrong there. Okay, oh yeah, well, let's talk to Taxi Guy while we have the opportunity to. Um, oh, it's vibrating here. This is gonna be something. Coins, yay! The Toad of Grade runs a store, I know about it. Don't worry. Whoa, okay, there's a coin bundle. Man, we don't find too many coin bundles. Like the last time we found one was on Cascade Kingdom, basically. All right, so let's talk to you. I shouldn't be surprised, but I am, it's you. Remember when we met at the Sand Kingdom? Yeah, we started at your home, and now we're at our home. I love this place, gentle, peaceful, ah. Makes, the, makes me want to settle down, or at least give you this. Yeah, okay. A tourist in the Mushroom Kingdom. Driver, good job. Get one more place to go. Back home. Take me to the Sand Kingdom? Glad to, friends. I'll, I'll get you home just as soon as I can. I'm just gonna load up on antifreeze first. Okay, so that's pretty cool. Uh, we'll have to go back to the Sand Kingdom once again when we start wrapping things up. Not now, though. Who should we talk to? A lot of these people we've talked to, but Peach is gonna be back at the castle, and all visitors are welcome at the castle. There's also a little Mario we can touch. And then, oh, talking to you. Maybe talking to you could be helpful here. Hey, buddy, it's just there's so much going on. There's. Certainly something with that that uh, Tanuki dream. What is the secret you're seeking? Pops out of the tail. Yeah, it's right there. I know about it. All right, so is it the bird or the? I think it's I, I think it's actually this. Yep. Okay, so it popped out of the tail. That one was pretty simple. Got it. Pops out of the tail. Good stuff. What about anything else? Oh, is there anything? Up top here, oh, just normal coins. I was hoping maybe for some purple coins, but that's okay. We still have 12 more purple coins to find. So talk to, hit me up with some more info. Uh, Sunken star in the sea of clouds, oh. Hmm. Maybe the vine leads up into the sky. What's the secret you're seeking? I can, let's see. Herding sheep at Peach's castle, I've been working on that one. I might not want to uh, go into the castle just yet, because I'm afraid if we go into a building, it will undo our progress with the sheep, so maybe I should just find the remaining sheep. Maybe that'll be my little adventure for right now, and if I find any potential moons on the way, you know, more benefit for me, that scroll pop into a coin. I hope I didn't do anything to him. That'd be awful. Anyways, there is some stuff here, a little well. Oh my, that is creepy, I don't think I've been down there yet. I don't know if I, oh no, I, might have been. Because I remember this pipe thing here. So let us start start leading you over that line. Oh, you're flying on over. Move it, move it, move it. Come on, come on. You got it, I believe in you. Move over here. Okay, I'll, okay, that's the wrong direction entirely. So I don't want that. I've. Oh, this one I haven't been in, as you can see. Because the hat house door isn't busted in, or at least I haven't fully completed it. All right then. Looks like they're having a nice conversation. I'd eavesdrop, but I, I got something more important that's going on right now. Come on, a little bit more over, and that is halfway through. I don't see any purple coins in around here. All right then. So, let's go back over there. Cause I'm pretty sure they're just sort of, you know, surrounding the perimeter of everything. Maybe if I got myself a, one of these, I could make my way around faster, which would be great. I don't think there's any in the pit. Oh gosh, don't fall in the pit then. Here, sheepy sheep sheep. I know you're around here somewhere. Only a matter of time till I find you. There's one right there. So that's gonna be four out of six. 
Maybe I could find more on my way over, because I am starting to run out of ideas, because I feel like I've done like a full loop around, but I might have missed something. I know we gotta get back up onto that rocket ship, because there's more we can do there. Um, I don't want to do it. It's a really difficult Mario challenge, but I feel like I might be able to do it if I get the eyes correctly, because that's what happened with the Goomba one on the, on the Cloud Kingdom. I was actually getting the eyes confused, and because of that, I actually ended up losing a lot of points. So let me just keep moving this guy. Uh, he's gonna bump into a little bit of everybody. But that's just a part of his charm. All right, we're almost there. Almost there indeed. He, it's down that way, so I am heading him the wrong way. Go down that mountain. Thank you. Feel like I'm being a little rude to him, but at the same time, he needs to hurry it up. But finding these next two sheep, I feel like that's gonna be the difficult thing. Because I really just don't know where they're gonna be. I don't need to knock them anywhere. So might as well do that. Two more to go. Where could they be? I mean, they could be, there could be one down here. Haven't explored this water area too much. There's another tower here I've yet to do too much with. Oh wow, there's plenty of purple coins around here. And a pipe. I'm not gonna worry about the pipe. Oh, I want those down. I want those coins, I need them. No, don't disappear, coins. Oh, I missed one. Oh wow. Oh, there is a golden nut down here, so that's the final golden nut. So I might as well go ahead and grab that if I can, just like that, and then I will go pick it up. Go back up to the surface, butt slam back down, so that I can go and grab these three purple coins. This will be 91, and then there's six more over here. We have this one. Oh, you are vibrating like crazy. Or maybe that was the water. Ooh, let's put it together we are, you're adorable. I'll be back for you, we, we have to hang out more. So now I'm at 94, this will bring me to 97. So if I can find one more cluster of three, I've gotten them on, right? Yep, one more cluster of three is all I'm looking for. That actually happened way quicker than I thought it would. I mean, there were a lot of purple coins in this one dense area, which is pretty cool. But for now, where can I find more sheep? I'll probably find at least one more on my way over, but I wanna be diligent. So if I could like hop up here. So I didn't see any over here. Unless, you know, like, I just wasn't paying attention as much as I thought. Look at all these birds. There's birds from every kingdom here. That is so cool. The exotic bird life. Oh, hey, one thing, there's the sheep, and there is the one to the snow kingdom right here, so we'll have to check that out soon. So you're gonna be right there. I know where you are, so I'll come back for you. I'm not gonna teleport, because I'm really afraid that's gonna make it, so it relocates all the sheep, but I know where that one sheep is, so it's just about going back here. And that's just more coins. You're just following me around. I already found your moon, though, so I'm not really too worried about it. And then we're looking for one more sheep, so if I can see him off on the horizon, that'd be great. There's just so many things to see in this kingdom, it's insane. That's why I love it, it's one of my favorites. All right, I'm quite proud of this garden, you tell me every time, and I'm here every time to listen, Toad. We're good friends. There we go. So we just that's just a matter of time. Those are three guaranteed moons right there. Let us run around, then and go to Mr. Sheep. Should be way over here. But should we, oh, we should not go into the painting yet. Because the last thing I want to do is, once again, have that reset the sheep, because that'd be the biggest pain in the booty. So, all right, Mr. Sheep, I'm gonna move you this way. Yeah, we're gonna hit you like that. I mean, I, I feel bad that I have to hit him at all, but I really need to speed up. <laughs> we'll hit him one more time, and then please don't land in the water. Ah! Oh, okay, he's fine. I thought that was gonna make it so that he was gonna disappear, because you know, it would be difficult to hit him out of the water. But no, he can walk across it, no problem. Okay, we just need to hit you one more time. And that should get you, we just gotta scare you in there. And then we need to find one more little sheepy sheep. Where could it be? Who knows? First off, getting these. Another heart, boom. I think it's gonna be over on the other side of the, the thing here. Because we've found a lot in this corner of the map, for a good reason. It's Makes it so much easier. But I really do think it's gonna be somewhere around here. So let's try to be a very diligent searcher. We found one over here that wasn't like too hard. But I think there's more. I think there's more for sure around here. I mean, there's only one more. Oh, then there he is. What'd I say? Can we hit you up there? Oh, look at that. The skillful moves of a sheep herder. Uh, not a sheep herder, but a herder. I don't, I don't hurt. Not intentionally. I'm just trying to get these sheep to a safe location and get some coins or Goombas. You know what, Goombas, leave me and my sheep alone. That's all I wanted was P 
peace and freedom with our sheep. Okay, ready? Whoop! Got it. One more good hit should send him spiraling in the correct direction. Okay, maybe not exactly spiraling or correct, but a direction, yes. Oh, oh, come on. No, 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 don't do that. Don't do that. Where do you think you're going, huh? Where do you think you're going? Wait, why are you ruining this for me? Come on, this could have been so easy. It could have been so simple. Ready, and got him. Finally, that was a tough one. So there is another moon for us. Thank you so, so, so much. Herding sheep at Peach's Castle. Let us go and get the, the painting done. Cause I'm gonna forget that. I'm gonna be like, wait, what is the Snow Kingdom one? So get that done really quickly. And that's all the Snow Kingdom things done except for three purple coins there that I just don't wanna be bothered with right now. I mean, maybe they'll be up there, but I highly doubt it. Anyways, go on in, see what we find. Hopefully something cool. And here we are. So I have to take a nice long sip of my tea, so I did that. Get that, get this, and thank you. Hooray, Secret Path of Shivarian. And maybe I can look up, look off the uh, the edge here and see if I can't just really quickly spot the three purple coins I'm missing. Not getting very lucky with that, so I think we will save it for another time. Back to the Mushroom Kingdom. So I guess it's high time to start checking out some stuff around here. Are bigger mushrooms extra bouncy? Plenty of bounce in those smaller mushrooms. Big, small, whichever, all mushrooms all look tasty. So we obviously did the Cooper Run. That was actually the first Cooper Run we ever did. Get all these coins again, because why not, they're still here. I can hang out with, uh, what's your name here? Uh, ow, that hurt. Sorry, but uh, I was just trying to see if that would get me a moon. So I can swim with you, you don't seem to be up to much, but I can maybe get onto your head. Ready? Nope, all right, sorry for abusing you. I'm mean to the sheep, I'm mean to the, Nessie, that's his name, Plessy is his name. That's what it is. <laughs> oh, look at this! Okay, so this is where this rematch is. I figured we'd be starting the rematches soon, so I guess we'll get started with this one. Oh, I love that. So, wow, this is a bit different. You are angry. So it looks like the challenge here is that there's no ocean to reside on. So we're gonna have to, I guess, manage our water a bit better. That might be a bit difficult. How are we gonna do that? Or is there water below us? Oh, that refilled it. Ow, that hurt. I'm gonna chase you around then. Okay, so there is, like, I guess we're getting moisture out of the clouds or something weird like that. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Gosh, you got all that lava off you. I mean, somehow you don't like that, but weird. I don't really get how that works. Like, I can't be too low, but I, and I get knocked all the way out. Great, let's try it again. <laughs> That is so weird. Uh, so I'm gonna skip the cutscene that it gives, if it'll allow me to, or not. No, hold on, skip it. There we go. Whoop, yep, got it. And then just move it, move it, move it. So I guess this, it doesn't refill it anywhere. You have to be low near the clouds, but it's very hard to see. And the cutoff point is pretty low. Okay, so that's low enough down. Move it, move it. And then get up, okay, or not. Oh, oh, that actually works. I actually had no clone. Um, okay. Well, now I know. Can damage you up a little bit more. Yay, okay. So we just filled up a little bit. I gotta wait for him to start stop spinning. He moves up and down a lot more though. Um, let me go ahead and try to damage you like that if it'll work, but whoa, holy cow. Please stop shooting that stuff at me, sir. Ooh, I don't think that's going far enough to actually hit him. But now that he's lower, that's all that really matters anyways. Because we can just damage him like that. Ooh, close enough, almost good. Got him, okay, so there we go. It's refilled again. I really don't get how that works, but I guess they don't have to. There we go. You're, you're going upwards. I just need to wait for you to stop spinning because that's like, the indication that you can't take hits. Cause I can hit you right in the face right now. But um, it's a little bit difficult to handle that. Okay, okay, you're shooting multiples at me. Come on, come on. That hurt you a little bit more. I was hoping you could lower yourself down. Two, three, and I'm just gonna shoot right at your face. Oh no, you're shooting a lot more than three this time. Give me that, and then if I could just get over there. 
then maybe it just this is just enough, maybe? Jeez, he won't give up for this one. All right, just do that. Man, I, I can't believe I missed all of those, and now I'm down to one hit. This is weird. Okay, now you're back to spinning. Thanks, and I'm dead. This is really awkward without anything in the like area. It's hard to tell how close he is, and I'm moving farther away from him, but it's, just, it's really weird. All right, so I got two hits on him again. I'm just looking for that third and final hit. It's really hard to dodge him when he's swinging around like this all crazy and everything. Where'd he go, where'd he go? Oh my gosh, it's just weird when you see this endless void. But I just need to keep chasing him until I get close enough to hit him. And then eventually he sort of just lets you um, get above him, but for the first little while you wanna hit him like this. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, that didn't land too many of them. Um, yeah, it's really, this last, this last phase is super tough. This is where I took all my damage last time. Come on, come on, and then you're gonna start spinning again. So I don't wanna deal with that, and I'm gonna have to deal with it anyways. Gee, thanks, dude. You are a pleasure. And you just don't lower yourself anymore. So the only way to do it is to sort of hit him in this really awkward way that is just, it's hard to get any hits on him at all. And then he goes back to spinning, like, right away this time. Holy cow! Come on, come on. Get right over there. And Ow, thanks. And I'm back down to one hit again. I take all of my hits on this final phase. Cause he like never lowers and then like he has like, he gives you one chance. It's really weird. Um, no, that's not close enough, but you can't get too close to him. And that would I just, oh, because you keep moving farther away. Like honestly, so far this is the weakest rematch. It's super awkward. And I'm missing cause this is, oh man. And I finally get a chance to, and he goes back to spinning. Buddy, stop your spinning. Go get a spinner. Get a fidget spinner or something. That'll make you happier. Come on, come on. Oh, no, I missed. Oh my gosh, oh, I don't like this one. I really think this is a weak rematch. It's just, it's just not really well set up. I just think it's awkward. Come on, come on, he's so close to getting taken out. You can see the top of his head is all red. There we go. Jeez, that last little bit is so awkward, that last phase. <laughs> yeah, we still have to do this. Like we just magically teleported onto his head, but I don't care how it's done, we get a multi-moon for it. I feel like that's awesome that they do still give you multi-moons. It's definitely an easier way to get all the moons. So let me go ahead and get these. I hope there wasn't anything at the bottom of the cork, but I'm going to assume that there was not. It'd be a really lame thing to do. But we got a multi-moon for the millionth time. Battle and Bubble Lane rematch. Not a good rematch, in my opinion, but um, a rematch nonetheless. Okay, so there's that one done. There's another tower right next to here if we wanna get that done now. Because we are now 24 out of 104, so we still have 80 more moons to go. I really don't think we're gonna be able to do all that in today's episode. Depends on how many of them are Todet moons. So maybe I should try to find that out soon as well because we still just have lots of work ahead of us. It's a very busy time here in the Mario Odyssey world, but it always has been and always will be, right? Let's go into here and find out what this rematch is. Oh, hey, it's this. This is actually another one of the boss fights I don't like. I'm not super fond of this one. At least the part where you have to climb up the his spew of pink goop. It's just super weird, no matter what angle. Oh, and now there's this stuff. Oh my, I see how this is more difficult. Uh, well, uh, well, excuse me. Thanks for uh, being in my way. I'm just trying to dodge as much as I can. Please don't hurt me. I mean, right now, is there not, there's not too much I can do to really hurt you. Ow, that, that was just a lucky shot. All right then. But I found that if I wiggle the controller, I can move a lot quicker. Tremendous. But it's not this one that's difficult. So once we have to make the jumps and the perspective doesn't really help you too much with that, luckily some of these still have health in them. Like there was no health in the other battle, so at least from what I could find. Okay, so there's more health. Hopefully that'll stay there forever. So I just want you to keep chasing me and I just need to keep moving. Um, oh boy. Oh, come on. Okay, well I'm going back this way then. Did you just sort of shoot at me? It's hard to stay away. See, this one's not too bad either. You can just stay relatively in the center. Don't hit me with that stuff, you dingus. Just like that, I understand, I agree. It is just like that. But uh, just please don't take any necessary damage from the little spinners. <laughs> sure, save those for the last boss battle, you know what I'm saying? 
Uh, okay, that's all the extra health we get. So we need to dodge as much as we can. I mean, you can see where they're sort of falling now. It's way easier to see the shadows of the, I guess they're like honeydews. Maybe that's not the right word, not the right uh, fruit I'm thinking of there. But you can see the shadow of it. He's gonna start doing this. And once again, this is just so super difficult in my opinion, especially when he's shooting those things. Come on, come on. No, yeah. What the heck's happening? Go closer. There we go, jeez. It was like not getting closer. That was really weird. But we did it. Holy cow, we did it on the first try. Go into that soup, you little monster. Yay, multi-moon. So there's that rematch completed, and with it, three more moons. So let's get over here, and it would be funny if we just die here and just accidentally hop out. I'm sure somebody has done that and felt awful and had to redo the boss fight. Okay, two multi-moons done, that's a pretty decent six moons of progress then. And I know there's at least one more tower we haven't entered. So I'm not really sure where that'll be, but I'm sure we'll find it. We will look for it. We've only, we haven't found a ton of moons in today's episode. Doesn't seem to be much of a bump. I think that if we should, we should look for all the possible vines like this zone, because I'm pretty sure that one of them, come on, motion controls work, is gonna lead up to a thing in the, in the clouds. Or maybe that is something we can find in the castle. I love how many birds there are, it's so cool. But yeah, I think that's something we can end up finding. It could be in other places as well, but I honestly have no clue. I traveled here with that dear, dear Dory. Cool. I wonder how Dory traveled. It's a little crazy when you think about it. I just thought there was more than one Dory like in Seaside Kingdom. I'm not sure then. Um, okay, so we got those. Did we go into here yet? This door is actually closed. Let's go into this one. What is inside here? Oh no. How much more difficult, because we, we struggled this with, with this one for the first couple of tries. Let's see what we gotta do. Here's big dude, whoa. I do not like those. What is gonna be different about this one now? Oh! He's got his dukes up right away. Doesn't have anything to say though. Usually he's like, where's the band? He knows where the band is. Oh wow, they got the little zombies. Oh, that ain't good. There we go. So I can punch through them luckily. So if that's it, that actually won't be too bad unless that'll, like they, they give us like a ton. We'll have to see, huh? Okay, so you're about to throw the fists of doom. Not too bad, oh here we go. That is actually quite tough. Come on now, we need to do that two more times. You're gonna make more ice shards fall. I almost ran right into that one. Come on, dude, just start your punching. Start your punching. Right over here, perfect. And then, wait. Oh, that was awful timing. I almost got it then. Gotcha. Nice indeed. We got one more we gotta do like that. We should be able to handle it, but I'm not sure. Can I break these? I can't. He can though, of course. I'm hoping that one of them has a heart in it so I don't have the risk. Oh geez, I forgot about this move. I don't like it. And he does it multiple times and every time he spawns some zombies. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Stop spawning zombies! I don't appreciate it. These are everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. Punch right here. Get it, got it. Go, go, go. Whoa, whoa. Oh, come on. Okay, I forgot how that worked. I thought I was gonna cancel it right away, but we got a first try again. See it. He's like, err, that didn't feel nice. Okay. <laughs> that is cool. So there is another multi-moon. We've get, now gotten nine moons worth of multi-moons in today's episode, and I'm glad for it, because it just ups our total like crazy. Because we're looking, I think, once again for, eight, it might, might be more than 800 moons. I saw some people say 800, but I know we're only like 30 away, and we all, obviously have more than 30 to go here. Whew, so much, so very much in this game. It's insanely huge. Okay, well, never have to be in here again. See ya. On to the next area, I guess. Something like that. I mean, what other boss fights? We've already, like, it, it seems like all the non-brutal or Bowser-related boss fights are here. So, there was none of that in the Cascade Kingdom. Well, yeah. None of that in the Cascade Kingdom. There was none of that, well, we did the Sand Kingdom one. We did the Lost Kingdom one, I think. I'm pretty sure. We did, there was no Lake Kingdom one. 
totally losing my thought. We did the Metro Kingdom one, the Ruined Kingdom one. Beyond that, there was there was no Snow Kingdom boss fight. We just did the Seaside Kingdom one. So I think that might really be all of the rematches that we can find in the Mushroom Kingdom. I'm not entirely sure, but I'm pretty sure. You know? I don't know if Yoshi has more moons he can give me, because have you noticed that the, the the fruit that we've collected is all grayed out now. I wanna see if there's anything more up here. Current altitude is impressive. <laughs> okay. We're still looking for three more purple coins. I don't think they're gonna be up there. But I think we should get Yoshi again, because one thing, he's our good buddy Yosh. But yeah, we should get all of the uh, fruit that hasn't been collected. Because clearly that has a purpose, if it is like that. All right, it would be funny if this was uh, more of a secret. It would be cooler if this was more of a secret than it is. All right, I'm ready when you are. Boink. Yoink, there you go, perfect. Yoshi, I love you. Let us go over here and get some fruit then. There's plenty of fruit to get. Starting with over here, oh, I missed it. Come on, oh yeah, that's right, Yoshi can't, or can he? Because before I didn't know how to tongue things, but now I do. So that filled up a lot. Hmm, yo, see how we've gotten those two? Haven't gotten these two down. Oh man, this reminds me of the Force Evolution from Super Mario World. I'm pretty sure I said that the last time I was here, but I can't avoid not saying again, I love the Force Evolution. I wonder if there's any purple coins hanging off like a ledge over here. That could be possible. And then I think some of these two are, let's see what that does. Oh, it does give me another moon. Okay, our star. Yoshi's second helping. I think there's even more. I mean, maybe not. If I take a look, I thought there were some up there. There is. Does Yoshi have a third helping? Oh, wait, wait, I wasn't ready for that. Well, oh, oh, no, okay, so I don't know if I could do it that way. But I can just bounce off of this, fly up there, and get that. So if I can look around very diligently, I might be even able to find a third helping of fruit around here. Because for the first half of the kingdom, there really isn't too much. Hello, Yoon. Can I, oh, hey, look, it's, I didn't find you before. Um, I don't think. <laughs> How'd you find me out where I was hiding? I thought the spot was pretty clever, too. Don't tell anyone I'm here, please. Here's a gift for keeping quiet. Sure, so there's another one. Hide and seek Mushroom Kingdom. Cool. So let's go ahead and look around some more and for some more fruit, and I might get lucky, you never know. Oh, I like how Yoshi's tongue can do this. I think it's just gonna be another mushroom. Oh, not mushroom, but um, health. In other games, it would be mushrooms for health, but not this one, because it's a weird Mario game. There's definitely a third helping, and he fills up a lot quicker now, which I appreciate. Can we eat you? Yep, <laughs> I love that tune. Um, Where are these last couple fruits? They're gonna be around here somewhere. Can Yoshi walk in the water? He can, of course. I mean, in Super Mario Sunshine, he can't. He instantly just disappears. The captain went to the shop. I think we saw the captain already in this, this kingdom. We've done this for sure. Always drive safely, I know, don't lecture me. What about this? Um. I actually don't know. Hello. I'm guarding this power room from Goombas. I'm not scared, nope, not me. So we need to become a Goomba to get that one. I remember that one now. Then what about in here? Oh, we already went in to do that one. I'm almost positive. Uh, Where could these last fruits be? I'm looking high and low, but there's no more I can see. I mean, they could be. Oh, so he does disappear in the water, just not shallow water. All right, well, I only need to find a couple more. So if I could just search around and find those, that'd be great. If you hear that. Oh, that's just you again, okay. Uh, I don't see any right now, but they surely could be around anywhere. So if I just find them, I gotta nab Yoshi and do that again. So now just, how about I become a Goomba and do that one, and then we'll go into the Mushroom Kingdom, say hi to Peach, I think. We came with a friend, but I must say, he's been quite a scamp. He's gone off on, gone, gone off on us. Uh, he must be somewhere, likely riding on someone's head. I already found him, but I won't tell you. Because he told me not to tell you what he paid me for. And Mario is a man of moolah. You gotta know that first and foremost. I mean, I don't know how much the Mushroom Kingdom pays him, but I'm guessing a pretty penny. Huh. 
It was just a cool landing, but I still don't see this extra fruit. Well, right now I don't have to worry about it. I have to worry about being a Goomba, which is a very worrisome thing. Who wants to be a Goomba? I mean, maybe Goombas do. Maybe I should be a bit more respectful. Jeez, Zebra, you're such a jerk sometimes. Okay, so let's get across to here. It's definitely not gonna be in the water, which is relieving. It just means one less place I have to look. I should still look in the waters though, because there could be the last three purple coins. Hi, are you scared? I'm all scared here on Goombas, and why'd you say that? Toad Defender. Well, I don't know about, I mean, I guess it's more Defender Toad. We're not defending any toads, though. Okay, so let's get across to here. All three of these are available now, which is great. So let me, oh, get it? And that is Gardening for Toad Field Seed. We can get across to this one. These aren't too bad to grab because I can stand on the hedge, but somehow I still miss. Gardening for Toad Pasture Seed. And then finally, Gardening for Toad Lake Seed. So we found all the seeds, fantastic. And I scared the, the, the toad away with the Goomba. Oh, there, they're right up there, what do you know? Okay, I wonder if I can get up here in one. No, there's no way I'm getting up there, at least not from this angle. Uh, one, two, three. Oh, is she right here? I heard her. Maybe she's inside and we can hear her calling from inside. That's really weird. We'll go in in just a moment, Peach. Hold on. We're just busy. We're gonna get Yoshi one more time and get the three. Yeah, those three. Luckily, it's super easy to get up here. Just one more time up. Oh, yep, got it. So, Yoshi, buddy, I need your assistance. Oh, can I just ride you? It'd be so cool if I could just ride you. But he's just totally against it in this game. Let me get across to there as much as I can. Oh, whoop. Whoop, got it. There we go. Wait, that wasn't enough, there's still more? No way. Where's the last one? I have no clue. It has to be just snuck around somewhere then. Good view for looking for him, if not anything else. Huh. I'll have to, oh, she's up here. Hey, how you doing? My travels with Tiara were wonderful, so many memories. And I realized something. How important it is to see different things and talk with different people. And no matter what kingdom you're in, people smile with the same little sparkle. We have to do what we can in with our time to put smiles on pe as many pa faces as possible. So I've decided to invite people from all over the world to the castle. Our travels were wo just wonderful, so many smiling faces. I picked up one last power moon as a souvenir for you. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you. Awesome, so that's a good lesson to live by too. You know, there's smiles all over the world. So I think I said Princess Peach home again or something. You're still on your journey, right, Mario? Cappy, good luck out there. All right then, it's such a big world out there. Indeed it is. We can't go into this painting now. <laughs> can Yoshi go into the castle? I don't think he can, so we're probably about to lose Yoshi. That's fine. I'm glad every, oh, yep, I'm glad everybody's seemed to be happy. Welcome back, Mario. Miss Tiara is back with us soon. I wonder if we can get up here yet. I, I, I wonder if there is, but, cause you know, there's one we have to find in the cloud. Princess Peach is back. Hi there, Cappy. Got some extra coins there. Princess Peach is on the bal balcony, I know, no, no. Don't worry. I don't know then. Weird. Anyways. Hmm. I am starting to running out of options. I mean, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. Sunken in the sea of clouds. I'd imagine that'd be up in a cloud related area. So maybe I should talk to talk to a bit more, find a couple more moons, stars, whatever they are. And then I can start resigning to talking to Toadette to get a ton of Toadette stars. <laughs> because we have a lot of those to definitely get. Oh, hey. I don't think you are one. I think you're just uh, an, a UFO. <laughs> I think you're just the moon's uh, version of a bird. So where's Talkatu at? He is going to be over here, right? I forget where he is. He's over here, just chilling out, being all cool. Hi. What is the secret you were seeking? I know it, I know, haha. -ha. I can't tell you, but I'll give you a clue. Secret 2D treasure. Oh yeah, those ones, those ones stunk. So what did those two, or one of them at the least? What else? Um. Totally classic, I think that's also it too. 
And is that all you're gonna tell me about? Sunken Star in the Sea of Clouds. I don't know that one. So, we did have to go back into that well. My memory was trying to chime me back to something. The fact that I gave up on it because it was so gosh darn difficult. Maybe it'll be a bit easier. We've played so much of the game since then that maybe my skills have improved at least slightly. I am so nervous, so I don't want to deal with this, but we gotta. This is not gonna be so fun. It's so difficult. Mm -mm. I know there's probably more than one power mode here. Because the thing is, is that if we leave this box, we're done for. It's over. Ready? Up! Oh. And I'll do it from from the beginning again, just in case, I don't know, you didn't see that episode, even though you should check them all out. I don't see why you took this episode out, but not the other one. But hey, that's your choice. Ow, that hurt. Yeah, I gotta be careful. Oh no, I know we did actually find one of the moons here. It's right here. I need to pick it up if I don't want to get taken out here and already do things over. Well, I'm doing things over. <laughs> that was me rushing a bit because I wanted the health. If I just play it carefully, I know what I'm in for now. I remember it a bit more. Maybe there's even final purple coins here. Oh, that wouldn't be fun, but it's totally possible. Nothing up there. Get an extra couple coins. At least this is a decent way to grind for some coins, you know? Not a ton, but it's something. Okay. Let me, oh, got it. And then, oh, gotcha. All right, so, so far, so good. Not dying as much, or not getting hit as much. Oh, come on. It's so easy to get ahead of yourself with it. It's super duper tough, and this isn't even the hard part. The hard part's coming up. I just gotta be careful, and then maybe let it shoot one more time, just like that, perfect. Now, this place is rather scary as well. You need to do small jumps. Small jumps if you don't wanna get hit a bunch. Oh, and I didn't see that one. It's just, oh, it's so much. It's just way too much. Why this much? I don't understand. Okay, well, I did that, and now this is gonna match up, and I can take my time for a moment before it starts moving, but this one moves upwards, so let's move across like that. Move it, move it, move it, move it. Get up here, move it, move it, move it, move it! Up up here, up up there, run, jump, jump, run, man! That's what your name is, run man, jump man, or something, jump man, not run man. <laughs> Got it, okay, so that's, the decent part done. This is where things get rather difficult, and I'd say quite ridiculous, uh, because the controls get really wonky here. And whoop! Oh okay, god! Okay, I got. Okay, okay, I gotta move this way. Forgetting how to say words. Whoop. So I can move this way and find a number of things. The thing I want to find, I have no clue, but I can only hope it's an. Uh... Oh! <laughs> okay. I didn't know I could duck under these guys, but then the controls get wonky, and I'm about to die again. <gasps> okay, so, oh, please don't die here. Oh, 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 I did it! Secret 2D treasure. Where is this pipe gonna lead? Could there possibly be three moons in here, or is this gonna lead me on the exit? It leads me back here, which makes me really hope there's no purple coins on the other part of that. Oh, I hope I didn't just make a major mistake, but I really have no way to know. So I'm gonna count it as that. If we pop out of here, and we see, there's still one, like a couple to find for sure. I know there's gonna be one for Yoshi's third helping at this point. I just gotta find that extra little apple. I'm pretty sure they are called apples in this game. Maybe they're not, but they sure do look like it. Okay, so Talkatoo's over here. Hey, talk to him. Uh, what is the secret you were seeking? Lose tile, wait, what did that say? Lose tile something. Oh, maybe that is, wait, I don't know. Totally classic, I still don't know that one then. Sunken star in the sea of clouds. Man, there are so many tough ones. I'm really having a hard time with them. Okay, Hint Toad, help me out here. Let's spend some coins, some very hard earned coins for hints. Okay, so there's one right there. Okay. Okay, so I just used Hint Toad, and it seems as though there is a hint right there. So we'll go ahead, or, or a moon, star, something. Right here. Uh, oh, is it on top, maybe? Oh hey, yeah, he's right here. I, I can't believe I didn't notice that. Great to be back home again, but you know, after my uh, my long trip, I'm seeing things here from a whole new point of view. I'll never hang up my adventuring hat, but for now, I'm glad to be back. Hey, here, one more power moon for you, so I just totally wasted 50 coins. Yay. 
Forever onward, Captain Toad. Maybe there'll be a new Captain Toad game. That'd be weird. I haven't played the first one, so maybe someday. Let us go ahead and talk to you again. We'll cough up another 50 coins. Let's see what the, if it's the Yoshi one. Like I know I can get on Yoshi to do something. I just, <sighs> it's actually like in the same location. Somewhere over, slightly to the right. Does it have to do with the dog? Wow, there's another, I, I swear that I found the dog one already. Maybe I didn't? Okay, if that's the case, then we gotta bring you all over the place to find where you wanna go. You could go virtually anywhere in this kingdom. So that might be a bit of a struggle, I gotta be honest, but we'll try to bring you to like each hilltop. Oh, well, this is the only real hilltop. There's a hilltop there and there, sort of. Cause I, I you know, you digged here, and I found this. But where, where else could you find something, maybe? Like maybe if we bring you over here, and, Oh, this might be a bit of a struggle now, won't it? <laughs> Little doggy, being a pain in the booty. Over here, huh? Gonna find anything over here, buddy? He's finding something. What it'll be? Do any of us know? I'm not really sure. And hopefully it is, just so it's easier for me. So I'd like to take my time finding other stuff, but hey, I guess extra health ain't too bad. Here, come here, come here. Uh, Maybe over here where the squirrel is chilling. And he always, dogs always sniff where the squirrels are. He's like, wait for me! Okay, over here? No. Up here? Uh, Not looking like it. Where do you wanna go? I mean, I don't think it's on top of this one, but at the same time, I don't remember checking, so it could be. Let's see what you find. You find something. Please let it be a moon. Please let it be a moon. Please let it be a moon. Thank you, little doggy. Okay, found a Peach's Castle. Good dog. So there's that done. Another one where I feel like I shouldn't have had to spend 50 coins to figure that one out, but I, I thought I did that already. Let's go ahead and talk to Yoon. Okay, by a hint, what's this one gonna be? Way over there. And that's gonna be the Yoshi one. I guarantee you it's gonna be the Yoshi one. Okay, so what else? Bye. Get another one. Way over there. So we should be able to go to talk to, maybe get a few extra new hints, and then maybe be able to figure that out. He might just give me repeat hints, because I don't think I've gotten anything done. Loose tile track down, yeah. So, let's figure out with what we've missed and what we haven't missed. We got something here, and don't know what that is, but it's Yoshi's third helping. Yeah, you can see that. Uh. And then this one is also unknown, but we might as well go over there and find out. So, there actually aren't too many teleport flags in this kingdom. I guess the kingdom is relatively small when it comes to the ground to travel, but it would be appreciated if there was an extra flag or two, and this would make it over pretty easily, but nope, we don't get that. So where is that? Um, I mean, I feel like you can see some like shadows moving from, I guess, the clouds, but, um, we gotta go more in that direction. And I wanna think it's just something we butt slam. I think there's something in the sky or something. It isn't moving from that spot. But there's nothing in the sky. Well, you see how it's like there's clouds here? I have a feeling it's something with the clouds, but I don't know, it's super weird. Okay, well, maybe we can do more adventuring of it in the next episode of Super Mario Odyssey. For now, though, I gotta go ahead in to the Mushroom Kingdom Castle and do the Toadette stuff, because I've been spending a lot of time just trying to figure it out, and it's been rather tough. We're definitely gonna have like one super long final episode at this rate. Let's talk to Yoon, see what we can get. Congratulations, Mario, you achieved something new. Your new achievement is achieve world peace. I know you can do it, have a power moon. You've earned it. So here's one. Okay, achieve world peace. I don't really know what that means, but okay. I don't know what I did to get that one. You got another achievement, Power Moon Knight. Don't know what I did for that one. Maybe this is just for unlocking certain power moons on like a certain amount. You got another achievement too, Power Moon Wizard. Yeah, these are definitely achievements for getting like a certain amounts of power moons. So maybe I have to go back to her when I have all the other power moons to get Power Moon Ruler, to get Master Power Mooner, Power Moon Master. This is definitely gonna 
up our amount of power moons like crazy. Regional coin shopper. I like that one. Regional coin shopper. And then once we do all of this, we'll be able to go back and see which ones we need. We got another achievement too, Flat Moon Finder. Flat Moon? I guess you mean like all the ones that are under the ground? Wait, you got another achievement too, Flat Moon Fanatic. Oh, all the portrait 2D side scrolling moons. I get it now, Flat Moon. It is indeed flat. We well, got another achievement, Treasure Chest Hunter, so moons that are in treasure chests. Cool. There are so many of these, it's insane. Like, we're gonna be here for a little while. Wait, you got another achievement too, Super Treasure Chest Hunter. That sounds like a video game title. Come on to a Nintendo Switch now, you're Super Treasure Chest Hunter. It's a game where you find treasure chests and open them, what do you know? Uh, no collecting world tour. That's cool. Maybe that's for all the note related ones. I think we've done all those, that's good. What else do you got? No collecting space tour. I guess for all the ones on in space. Cool, cool. Um, yeah, we're definitely racking up the moons with this. Timer challenge amateur. Yeah, for all the timer challenges. I think we've found all those as well, except for any that we might be missing here in the Mushroom Kingdom, but I think we found the most of them. Timer challenge professional. Ooh, timer challenges were really cool. I and mean, there's just so many cool things in this game. It's, it's fun to reminisce in ways like this. Well, you got another achievement too, Captain Toad Meter. I guess for finding all the Captain Toads. We have definitely found all the Captain Toads, I think. Wait, you got another one, Captain Toad Greeter. They just have different stages for them, I guess. You know, the more you find, the more rewards you get. And then you have Touring with Princess Peach. And then I'm guessing there'll be like Moon Touring or something, because there'll be more than one for Princess Peach, because we found all the Princess Peaches for sure. We got another one, Globe Trotting with Princess Peach. It would be cool if we could get like more details on what Princess Peach did on her vacation, because we just saw her at the places, but it'd be cool, you know, seeing her hanging out with people, you know, doing certain things. I didn't read what this one was. Master Sheep Herder. That's for probably, you know, we've only had three sheep herding missions. Gaga for Goombat. We did do all the Goombat ones. Those ones were cool too. Man, we're getting so many. We already have over 40, 44 moons right now. We got another Lakitu fishing trip. There was one in the Bowser Kingdom, one in the Sand Kingdom, and one in the Lake Kingdom. I think those were all the uh, Lakitu fishing. Got another achievement too, flower growing guru. Flower growing, I guess, yeah, for all the little flower patches. I'm guessing there might be another one of that because there were a lot of flowers to grow. Flower growing sage, what I say, what I say? What else we got? We're about, we're about to hit 50 moons. Collected right here, most of it being through this. Running with the rabbits, there'll be another one for rabbits for sure. Because we, well, we've captured a lot of rabbits. There's been one almost, I think almost one per kingdom. Racing with the rabbits, that'll probably be it. Unless there's raving with the rabbits. Mm. We, we didn't do any rabbits with dancing. We get another one. Ground pound instructor. I guess it's maybe just for ground pounding a lot. That one's weird. Um. Ground Pound Professor, that just has to be for ground pounding. I know there's ones for like jumping an insane amount of times. Got any more for me, Ground Pound? Rad Hatter, probably for finding a bunch of hats instead of Mad Hatter. I like it, I like it. Let's see if we can't get the 60 moons this way. Super Rad Hatter. <laughs> there's so many hats to find. We haven't found them on. We're almost done with all the costumes I can only imagine. Traveling Bird Herder. <laughs> So many birds to find as well. Too many birds to find, to be honest. Some of those birds were super tough. Like the one in Metro Kingdom, ugh. Well, you got another achievement too, wearing it well. That can probably be for all the costumes or for most of them. Got another one? Uh, Wearing it great, yep. There's just so many. You, you, you sort of get the sound like burned into your brain after a while. Well, you got another achievement too, Wait, wearing it perfect. Oh, does that mean almost everything? Like, wearing it perfect, do you think that'd mean everything? Or maybe all the ones where we have to wear something to get a moon. Hat seeking missile. Probably for landing our hat on things. I mean, we'll go through the uh, the moon list after this. M music maestro for finding all the mu music for the toads. Or maybe just unlocking all the music. Cause just going into an area, I think unlocks that area's music. I don't think we're missing any music at this point. Art enthusiast for finding all the hint art. 
which I think we found all of them at this point. We did that last episode. You go check that out. Uh, what well, you get another team? Art investigator. So we got over 60 now. Moving on to 61. Got any more for me? Well, you get another achievement two slots machine. Those were fun. I wish there was one more of those. Oh no, I just enjoy slot machines. They're just it, like fun to, especially when it was like in Mario where it's timed. You get another one, Koopa free running MVP. Uh, this one was fun. Of course, Koopa free running is one of my favorite things in this game, even though it's super challenging at times. It's just like Koopa the quick, but more. And I really like that idea where they sort of explored per previous things. Koopa free running Hall of Famer. That's us, the real Hall of Famer. Stand aside, folks. Okay, Um, what else we got? Supernaturally sure-footed. What? I don't know. There's probably gonna be multiple sure-footed ones on, right? Quiz master. Oh, that's for all the Sphinx quiz. Last one was super emotional and we got tons of coins for it, tons of money. Uh, Souvenir sampler. That's cool, we haven't found all the souvenirs. That's gonna be something when we finish the game 100%, hopefully soon, but we're making our way to 70 moons. <laughs> Souvenir sleuth. <laughs> that is just a tongue twister. I can't believe I pronounced it correctly. Come on, two more and then we're at 70. We got capturing novice. Oh, there's gonna be a lot of capturing ones, aren't there? Because we've captured so many things. This seems like the more you die and have to redo things in this game, the higher chance you're gonna have most of these completed. As long as you're collecting more coins than you're losing, you probably have a lot of coins if you die a lot. Capturing apprentice, there's gonna be a capturing master, I'm guessing. Capturing master. So three capturing ones at the least. And we've gotten over 70 moons now. Jeez, there's just so many. Hat, hat maven? I have no idea what that means. Uh, what else? Hat icon. Maybe this is for finding hats. What is a maven? I've never heard that word before. Well, I, I gotta be getting to the end soon. Fashion maven. And then another fashion icon. Cool. We have to be getting close. I can only imagine. I mean, there's over 100 moons in this area, but for a good reason. Mario must be getting tired. Just from jumping up and down like that over and over. I know like that's just like his job, basically. Moon Rock Liberator. Well, I did get all the moon rocks opened. Got any more moon rock related ones? World Warper, because we warped to all the worlds. Yeah, we found all the world warps now. And uh, any more? I, we had to be getting really close. Checkpoint Flagger. Yeah, I think we have found all the checkpoint flags because we found all the world warps. Warps, warps, warps. Any more for me? Checkpoint flag enthusiast. So we should be able to find all the checkpoint flag related ones, I'd assume, unless there's like one missing. Loaded with coins. That one's cool. I don't know if that's for having a certain amount of coins when you talk to her or for having a total amount of coins gotten throughout everything. Rolling in coins. And then there's probably more. Probably will charge me for the total amount of coins I would need to get uh, everything in the game. Swimming in coins. Good stuff. We've, like, I, I, I'm guessing we can track how many coins we've gotten throughout our adventure. It must be a ton at this point. I'm gonna say 30,000. Jump, jump, jump. That's obviously for jump on a lot. What do we got now? One, two, three, four, five, six, 83 moons. Uh, fly, Cappy, fly! I don't think he can fly. He can, I mean, I guess he sort of can fly, can he? Oh, that's it! I hope you achieve all of your dreams. That's a very nice thing to say. Uh, we've gotten these already. So let's check that out. Which ones are we missing then? Probably a ton. Um, but how can we tell if we've actually gotten it or not? Um, I guess it would be gone. Let's see, so obviously we did all of these. Collect power moons, 863. So there's no requirement for all of them. We've collected 868 out of 600 for the Power Moon Ruler. Which ones are we missing? And then we'll check some of these other bigger numbers. Oh no, maybe 30,000 was too high of a guess, so I'm sort of reeling back on that one. Did we get everything now? Collect souvenirs and stickers, we need 10 more for that one. And I know where to find those, it's just a matter of getting it. That's the only one we're missing, is that one, really? So as soon as we get all the purple coins, we can get all the souvenirs and come back and get that as well. All right, so where is, uh, Load of the coins rolling because we've got 19,625. So I was at roughly 11,000. Oh, that's a good chunk. <laughs> okay. 
So that means we only have one Toadette one to do that. I'm actually really surprised about that. But with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of... Uh, I was gonna say Mushroom Kingdom, Super Mario Odyssey. If you watched this point of the video, make sure you comment Zebra Star so now you've watched at the end and that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.